hit hard by a string of car burglaries. KBC 9's Dennis Evans is live near Rain Tree Lake. And Dennis, we understand residents are on edge there after several cars were stolen or broken into this week. Yes, Kelly, they are. This is a beautiful setting out here at Rain Tree Lake. You have the water here, you have the boats here, people outside cutting their grass, going for jogs, just doing a little bit of everything. Despite the setting, cars in this area still not immune to the same crimes that have struck this entire metro area. Now, police say a group came through here on Sunday night, and that group, well, early this week, many of them were driving what were already stolen cars. They dumped those cars that were out of gas, stole more cars inside this neighborhood. Now, police say a total of seven cars were stolen here or stolen and abandoned here. Now, neighbors say the crimes have shaken their sense of security, and they're hoping to see an increased police presence. I usually see them during the day. I don't know if they're planning on coming through in the night and especially in the hours, some midnight of 3 a.m. when most people strike, you know, and are least visible. But I would like to see us to have our own patrol system. Now, we visited with the police department today, and one of the things that they told us, they said that more police presence could be helpful and they will provide that, but they said cars that were parked. They had one car that was parked inside of a driveway and the key fob was left inside. They said they had several incidents like that and that made things so much easier for the thieves to come out here and to be able to steal the cars. The focus, they say, should be on security and people tightening up what they do inside their homes. Reporting live in Lee Summit, Dennis Evans, KBC 9 News. And the Lee Summit Police Department does have an online advice page on how to keep your vehicle and your home safe. You can go to the department's website and click on the SNAP page. That stands for Securing Neighborhoods and Property.